Hello everybody, this time, oh, I'm just switch it off, I don't know, oh, yeah, I think that is going to be fun. Hello everybody and welcome back or welcome if you're new, I hope you are sticking around for more of my videos or been watching some of the old one. and today I have, um, a memory plan with me so um, I think I just have two more videos like this one and next one and then I'm finished with the whole book and then I'm going to do a whole flip through of all of this and everything that I have and then just um, commenting on different spreads and everything so this week we are going to do week <coughs> Week three to week five. So we have three weeks, and then when I finish with that, then we have week six to week eight, and then I'm finished with the book. So let's start with this one. Then I I'm going to do what I usually do is to first dig down all of the good and then I'm going to talk about the week and how it went and everything but I think this is going to be like you're going to see me I don't know if you're going to see that maybe it's going to be like a switch in the, in the position or something because I don't going to do every week in the same day because I have not finished everything so I'm just going to film as I am finished with things so yeah, just let jump right ahead into the things and then enjoy the video. Oh, and I forgot to say one thing that uh, this uh, kit is from Planet Face, it's Sunset Vibes. And then the next one is also from Planet Face, it's Cottage Switch. And the last one is also from Planet Face and that is Berry Autumn. Yeah, then we're going to have...
Like so, that is my week three, and this week has been very busy. A lot of things have been going on. So, so on Monday, I started packing because we are moving, moving from Trondheim up to Kirkenes. So we had a lot of things to move, and then now that that is not packing for that but that that was packing because we were going home from my um from last weekend me and my boyfriend went home to my hometown to celebrate my grandma's birthday we packed and then took the flight home he went home around five five or one five and then i took out the trash um but we Clean this, like the the common area, and then we had takeaway for dinner, which was in this in the um, food, which was great. And then we just went and uh, got to bed very early because we needed to be out, up around eight the next day. So we just wanted a lot of rest. Now the next day we had alarm on seven forty-five. And then we drove to our landlord to pick up the, um, the truck that he borrowed us, which was very kind of him. So we could move all of the moving things or moving boxes, everything on the boat. So we are not going to take everything in the car. So that we had two like box pot, I don't know what to call it in English, but like two pot. Uh, places you have things on and then you just take everything on that and then we got to check out the landlord saw that uh, everything was fine in the apartment everything was clean and everything so he approved of that so we were out of the apartment around two and then the first thing the first like uh, car trip was was from Trondheim into Sweden, like soil is like uh, in near the border from Norway to Sweden. And then we just drove up to north. Then um, I was lucky that my boyfriend he drove almost or he drove the whole way up to the first like the whole two we came to Sweden the next day we went early up like 8 and then had breakfast from the hotel and then we left this time we um, switched on who was driving so I could do my part and he did his part so it's not that so he could get some rest at west and then when I uh, since a lot of the place, like a lot of the road up to Shekina is like very dis desert, like it's very isolated, not that many things around, like just forest and mountains and nothing else to do. So it's like I'm, I need to go on the bathroom and I need to go in the nature, but when I, it was like very snowy and very cold, but I need to go so. When I was on the toilet, uh, I when I was supposed to go up, I just fell in the snow and it was so cold, was like up to my knees or something. So not that great. I was very cold. And then, so I was very looking forward to change my clothes when I came f uh, to the hotel. So we were. Uh, there around 10 o'clock and then we were at the hotel we took a long shower I got to change my clothes which was very nice so yeah and then we took all, all yeah we did that in the two hotels that we were in we have a lot of plants that we had moving up from Trondheim to Schickness that we were moving up to a hotel so they're not 
uh, freezing in the middle of the night when there's not many much snow outside. So yeah. And then on the next day we went up around 8, we had breakfast and then there was uh, the breakfast was quite great actually. I am very picky with the uh, breakfast so that was very good. It was like a lot of different warm food and um, a lot of variety in the breakfast area so that was great. And then we were supposed to go and have a walk around, so like go into uh, Fortex and just look around. But it snowed a lot so we didn't do that, so yeah. And then we just went around 10 uh, to our apartment that we are going to move into. We got a uh, look around with uh, not a father but like a father-in-law landlord. He showed us around, gave us info and all that. So was, and then the most of the day we just just to pick up all of the things from the car into the house and just settle in for the day. And then we drove into town. We picked up some grocery and then uh, bought some furniture and a lot of smaller stuff. And since our like our kitchen appliance didn't work, we needed to use the oven to heat up a lot of stuff, so that was interesting. And uh, yeah, the rest of the day just to shower and relax for the day. Well, indeed, it was very mm, productive and good, good day actually. And then the next day we needed to. Today, and then the next day, since it snowed a lot that day, we needed to uh, plow. <laughs> My English is failing me today, but like, yeah, move the snow out so that we were able to use the car. But uh, the rest of the day, nothing, nothing special happened really. We had dinner. Uh, I talked with my father throughout the day and updated him on how the car went and what I have been doing lately and then I talked with my mother and updated her on how life up here was. So yeah, nothing special happened there and then Saturday was nothing really. Uh, I just wanted to be home and my boyfriend he just went and had a grocery shopping and errands while I was home and just relaxing. I need to, uh, it was snowing that day as well so I needed to, I want to know what this is called in English at least. <laughs> Annoying that I don't know what this is. Shovel, shovel snow, that is what it called in English. I shovel snow on Saturday as well and then was lazy the rest of the day. And we had like a fish burger, I think that we could do using air fryer because we have some appliances but just not on the stove. On the Sunday we had a lazy indoor day and just played games. My grandma called and I updated her on how the moving and how we are in general and talked about that. Then my mother called again to to ask me how, what I wanted to have in the car that uh, since my boyfriend he bought the car from my dad so he they are going to ship it over with the boat over to us up in the north so we could have stuff in the car so we can take down so yeah I got a lot of books there so that was good and then just yeah indoor day we had a uh, evening walk as well so it was not totally lazy day but we needed a lot of rest that day so that is that week is very contrasted because it's very much snow but yeah, the kit is very um, spring like so yeah but it's nice either way and then the next week is going to be a lot of a little bit darker and um, yeah you'll see that in, in a little bit <laughs> 